Hey everybody, um, I just wanted to do an updated collection and storage video. Um, it kind of looks the same, but it's really a lot different. Um, so we are going to start over here. Again, my necklaces are all the same and I have some storage up there. But I don't keep any makeup related stuff up there. The only thing that I changed was I put this bulletin board here up. Then I still have the same black holder, but I have some different palettes in here. I have my naked palette, um, I have my Z palette here. Then I have my 120 palette, um, the Tropical Shimmer palette from BH Cosmetics. Then I have the 28 Neutral from Coastal Scents. Then the, um, Last Christmas Too Faced palette. And then in the front here, I have this just little paper organizer. I have my Coastal Scents. Um, this is my Forever Neutral palette. I'll show it to you guys. Looks like that. And then I have three of the 32 palettes from e.l.f. And then I have my little stuffed Beanie Baby prickle or um, hedgehog. Then I have my hedgehog card for my fiance. I always keep that stuff there. And then same Joanne's cart. Um, it's a little different how it's stored. Um, the first drawer here is my blush drawer. Um, over here I have all my NYX blushes. Um, I do have seven of those powder blushes. Then I have um, a Physician's Formula blush, an Essence blush, and then two more of the Happy Booster blushes from Physician's Formula. Then I have a matte cream color base, um, my Vitamin blush, and then two NYX cream blushes. Then I have a Heart Candy blush, a oh, True Match blush, um, Beauty Powder from Villains, a couple, or one of the um, highlighters from Physician's Formula, my MSF and Light Scapade from MAC, and then my Happy Booster Translucent. Then I have a, um, like, kind of like shimmer brick from Physicians Formula, um, some drugstore blushes like NYC, Maybelline, and Wet n Wild. Um, then I have my Lonely Nars blush, and then I have all of Studio Line blushes here. Then I have my Fox in a Box blush, um, Maybelline blush, two of the blushable cream sticks, and two all over color sticks. Then here is like bronzers and highlighters that didn't really fit up there. Um, I have my Motives Shape and Sculpt, a Cashmere Wear Bronzer from Physicians Formula, um, a Jordana blush that I just use as a contour, and this is in Toast. Um, my e.l.f. blush, Booster Pearls from Physicians Formula, um, my favorite Physicians Formula bronzer, the Happy Booster. Milani Baked Bronzer, um, my Sunny Bronzer from NYC, then a Mosaic Bronzer from Physicians Formula. Then I have two e.l.f. bronzers, a Revlon Color Stay um, palleting powder, and then another all-over color stick and just a bronze shade from e.l.f. Then here we just have um, face necessities like eye creams, my um, gel moisturizer from Garnier, um, makeup wipes, which I need terribly, um, my face cleaner tool, and then the extra parts, and then just some eyebrow razors. Then here is just um, some lip balm products. This is my depotted um, Lemon Drop EOS, what was left of it. And then I just have balms and things of that nature in here. Um, here is my lips. It's pretty much still the same. I do have a ridiculous amount of lip products. Here is just all the tall glosses. Um, I have Rimmel, Essence, um, Revlon, some Hard Candy, some e.l.f. Then here is like clicky lip glosses, lip liners, any um, lip stain markers, any jumbo lip pencils, 
um, two wee lip glosses, all of that is in here. And then just some extra lipsticks here, mostly Rimmel, Maybelline, and just some kind of random here. And then this is one of the Q-tip holders from the Dollar Tree, and this has like my Wet n Wild and NYC lipsticks in there. Then some Tubi lip glosses over in the corner there. Then these ice cube, long ice cube trays hold my um, Revlon Super Lustrous, Elf Mineral lip glosses, any of my MAC lip glosses. Um, then my Rimmel, or not Rimmel, NYX lipstick there. And then I have one full of Revlon over there. I apologize if it got a little dark. Um, and then going towards my desk here, I changed this up a little bit. Here is all products that I reach for frequently. So it's like lip glosses um, that I reach for. Like I have my MAC Kissable Lip Color, my NYX Lip Liner Pencils, um, my favorite Revlon Color Burst Lip Gloss, my Under Eye Concealer, my White Eyeliner, um, my... Urban Decay Black Liners, um, my favorite liquid liner, which is the Physicians Formula Eye Booster, my mascaras, and, you know, things like that that are just right here where I can reach them. Then this little basket here, I got um, bases in here, colored bases that I use on a regular basis, so my NYX Jumbo Pencils, um, my Too Faced Shadow Insurance, my NYX Eyeshadow Base, Hard Candy Base, um, Elf Primer, anything that's taller goes in here. My um, LA Splash Glitter Glue, I just keep these here. And this I got at con the container store, this I just got at the Dollar Tree. Um, then going over here, my brushes are still the same. Dirty brushes go here. All my taller eye brushes here. Um, these little beads are poly pellets that I got at um, Catan's craft store. Middle is short brushes, um, shorter handles, things of that nature. These acrylic containers I got at the container store. And these are all my face brushes here. Then we go over and I have my MAC palette and this acrylic DVD holder. This I got at the container store and how I do it is um, I just have all my palettes labeled. Like this is my light neutral with the pinks and kind of highlights and transitional and colors. My dark neutral with um, browns, golden tones, um, grays and blacks in here. Then the next is blue green. Then we have um, purple and pink that aren't highlights. So, um, and then like kind of red things like that. And then my blush palette, which has changed since the last time you guys saw it. I have a full blush palette. Um, this is Dolly Mix Pink Swoon Instant Chic Cantaloupe. This is a pro color. Honor, um, which is more of like a highlighty color. Um, and then my Highland Honey. So I have that. And then on the top, I just have some trinkets like my MAC keychain teddy bear from last Christmas, my um, flat top kabuki from Physicians Formula, my little Mr. Prickle Pants, um, eyelash accessories from the e.l.f. kit, and then this shelf is new as well. This is, it's actually one of the magnetic shelves that I got during school time. Let me see. I can turn this light a little bit to get some of the glare off. Um, and this just holds my hand sanitizer, lotion, face lotion, um, my straightening, smooth down from Redken, Fix Plus lotion, brush cleanser from MAC, and then my Q-tips, just all in here. Then over here I have my tripod. Um, just again, more <laughs> Mr. Purple Pan stuff. <laughs> then this black thing is still the same. Pocket backs. Um, computer camera items, then I have swatch wheels here, and then I just keep my mirror. I really need to buy a new mirror because it broke. So upset. And then my lipstick container is from the container store. It holds all my MAC lipsticks, um, a Lonely Gemma Kid lipstick, and three of the Revlon Colorburst lipsticks. 
know, not and, like this is interesting. But in the drawer, I just keep office supplies, um, pens, my business cards, any business cards that I get from companies, and any paper just is in there. And then in here, I keep tools, um, like a mixing palette, magnet sheets, extra mirror. Um, this has any like tools to depot, things like that. Labels, staplers, um, extra poly pellets. These I actually are the lids from the acrylic containers which are nice to mix on as well. Um, and then this is kind of still almost the same. This is any highlighter products here. These are the e.l.f. Um, highlighting pens. Um, they're primer or primer. <laughs> the tinted moisturizer. All my primers. I have two hard candy and then an e.l.f. which I really just need to pitch the e.l.f. because I hardly ever use it and it's kind of getting old. Um, the concealer trio from Physicians Formula. Um, my under eye powder which is the eye mineral eye brightener from e.l.f. Matte concealer e.l.f. concealer palette and then the concealers that I readily use um, are here. Then over here are foundations. This Revlon Color Stay Active is about done so I need to pitch it. Um, I have my Photo Ready Bare Mineral sample that I'm trying. Um, this Rimmel foundation is pretty much a summer shade for me. It oxidizes and it's a little dark for me. And then my Kabukis are both e.l.f. Um, the e.l.f. Color Stay Aqua Powder if you'll ever focus. Then I have the Fit Me powder that I'm trying to get done with my MAC MSF and then my Complexion Perfection. Back here is brow items, brow gel, I need a new one badly, brow powder, um, my angled brow brush, my um, color that I'm using for my brows which is just in uh, Wet n Wild or NYC color, then a brow um, duo from Wet n Wild. Then I just have blotting sheets, my Chanel color in case I want to go back and get it, um, my NYC Smooth Skin, Physician's Formula Mineral Wear Talc Correcting Powder, and just some cotton doohickeys. <laughs> and then this is all new and that item over there too. Um, but this I got off of Shop NBC and it's the 10 drawer cart. Starting here I have my mascaras. Um, I really don't veer too far away from my mascaras. I really do like this um, voluminous false lashes. Um, I've been trying it and I love it. This is my old dryer um, lash accelerator. I've just been using the last of it. Um, any pencil liners that I don't like um, gravitate towards every day. I have a lot of them. Um, I have almost every color that you can think of. Um, I have Urban Decay, NYX, Rimmel, um, just anything. Physicians Formula. Then over here I have my cream liner in black from e.l.f. My Macroviolet Fluid Line. Um, a liquid liner from uh, LA Colors, my glitter glue from Hard Candy, Physicians Formula, Gel Liner Trio in Green Eyes, and then I have some liquid glitter liners here. Then back here is my like everyday, if I want to wear lashes, um, my eyelash curler and my um, lash glue and my um, sharpeners. We have MAC Paint Pots here. Um, I have a NYX Cream Base in white, um, Maybelline Dream Mousse Shadow, an e.l.f. Cream Shadow, and then um, just a sample of the Benefit Creaseless Cream Shadow. Then here is just kind of drugstore or lower end. These are the duos from Wet n Wild. Um, I have some Wet n Wild singles here one NYX shadow, then I have some of the Essence shadows here, then I have two Ulta shadows, um, an Ulta baked shadow duo, Jordana duo, and then I have a Joe Fresh trio. And then here I have all my Revlon singles, um, then I have two ELF single shadows, um, two L'Oreal 
single shadows, some LA color singles, some Maybelline singles, and some Rimmel singles. And then here is all um, either hip duos, which I have three back here, and then the rest of these are MAC bigger shadows, which um, I have the Pro Longwear, I have the Mega Metal, and then I have some of the what are those, the tartan eyeshadows, and then some mineral shadows. So there is that drawer. The next one is larger, um, like, trios or six-pan palettes. Here I have all my Wet n' Wild six-pan palettes. Then I have some trios from LA Colors, a NYX trio. Then I have all my quads from e.l.f., a Marcel quad. And then I have the shimmer palette from e.l.f. And then I have all my trios from Wet n' Wild here. Then some LA Colors five-pan metallic. One's back there. Here is like a bigger palette. Um, I have my e.l.f. palettes. These have like Urban Decay shadows or Annabelle shadows, Palladio shadows. Um, I have a couple Lancome. Then I have two Maybelline quads, three NYX um, 10 pan palettes, one for smoky eyes, one in champagne and caviar, and one for brown eyes. Then I have the baked um, six pan palettes from Wet n Wild. Okay, I do apologize. I ran out of room on the memory card. Um, then I have my four um, eight pan palettes from Wet n Wild. I have three of the shimmer strips from Physicians Formula. Um, I have a couple Urban Decay palettes, the um, Summer of Love, the Preen Shadow Box, and the Ammo palette. Then I have an Annabelle Custom Quad there. And then I have the Shady Lady back there. A Napoleon Partis set, NYC, and Wet n Wild Older palettes. Ah! One thing about the drawers, you have to close them exactly right. <laughs> These are my extra brushes. Um, anything that I just don't reach for on a day-to-day -day or um, for different uses, like maybe um, different looks, things like that. Um, so I have like the eye ones here, the smaller ones, and then I have face brushes here or foundation brushes, and then powder and like sling brushes over here. Then I have like a small brush um, travel case. And any of these containers that are in here, mostly got at the Dollar Tree. So this one's empty. This is anything to haul, um, and that lip stuff back there, my mom gave it to me, and I can't figure out what to do with it, because I won't use it. And then this is kind of a mess. This is anything to do custom nail polishes with. Um, I do have one Franken right here. It's called Mermaid's Tail. <laughs> um, but I'm looking for better glitter, and I need BBs, and like a... Um, a lot of other things to start doing Frankens with, but this is just kind of a couple supplies that I have so far. I just kind of throw it in here. <laughs> and then that's just more storage. Then down here is like my theatrical items, like cream makeup, um, jewels, any glue sticks, paint wheels, and theatrical lashes. Now over here um, on this little cart, I put my nail polish rack. Again, this still only has China Glaze and OPI. It used to have Zoya on it, but um, I just keep it by color. Then I keep the glitters down front and then the crackles back here. Then I just have some wipes. And then this, I actually should show this. I will um, take this and show this to you guys in case anybody might be interested in this. Um, this is a Clinique bag and I will show you what it has in it. It has the green concealer that didn't work for me. This is the um, Clearing Acne Solutions Concealer. The lotion from the Acne Solutions that's about three quarters of the way full. Um, the toner that's very full, hardly use any of it, and the spot treatment. 
Um, if anybody is interested in this, please just leave a comment. Um, I don't know how much I'll want for it, like maybe $15, because the concealer itself is $15, or um, if you guys are interested, just let me know, shoot me a message or whatever, but <laughs> it's just sitting there and I don't know what to do with it. And then, <laughs> anyways, under here is like my hair products, my bath products, um, summer lemon vanilla, and here is full of like samples cosmetic samples, things like that, samples I've got through the mail, but any hair products, um, I need a new dry shampoo is about out, huh, as I break everything, right, sweet Abby, you are so sweet, okay, then over here is my nail care items, like my acetone, polish remover, polish thinner, Avo juices, top coats, um, nail art, false nails um, and things like that that is my nail polish I just piled them the containers all up um, <laughs> I have a lot and if you want to look at that right over there I lost um, I'm actually out of swatch wheels so that is all the items that I still have to swatch on swatch wheels and I lost a notebook with a lot of color names so I'm like kind of on hold for that but over here I just have my jewelry. Nothing interesting. Here's just like magazines, notebooks, things of that nature. Then here is all my extras. My brush roll, my extra nail polish removers, um, my extra parts to my um, face cleaner, my extra moisturizer, extra backup makeup, um, extra EOS, extra my new color stay, which I should get out because I really miss this stuff. Extra hair dye. All that fun stuff. And then down here is just pretty much the same towels for um, cleaning my brushes, cotton rounds, alcohol, baby shampoo. Yada, yada, yada. Hope you enjoyed. I will talk to everybody.